three, You know, I, years ago, I'll never forget the time, the flame, the town hill in Brooklyn. Uh, I worked these great clubs. This is back in the 50s. And those were the days when I was a comic working all the clubs around town. And then I was in Okinawa. And there was a lady I, I worked with at the Town Hill in Brooklyn. I'll never forget it. It was Laverne Baker, Tweety Lee Tweety. And here she is. How have you been, my darling? Fine, fine. You look fine. good. Thank you. You've had some tough years in your I life, sure haven't did. you? Yes, I tough did. times, I should yeah, say. But God carries me right on through. Carries you on through. Right. right. You have no regrets in life, it seems. No. You have Every, everything. It's like when my legs, when I lost both of my legs. What I happened there, Laverne? Tell me. Exactly. I have diabetes. Diabetes. Yeah. Martha Ray had the same thing. Yes. And uh, but I wasn't. Uh, to depend on it, and I wasn't going to be depressing. Right. It. And I, I figured that I could do something with what I have, and God gave me a talent. I can use that, and I can train other amputees like me. I want to go up to the place where I used to work. Well, uh, uh, was when I was sick in the uh -huh. sick. And I like the way it is. That I feel so sorry for some of the old aging people in my, you know. And I know that when you're past 50, 55, I think there's something. You, you should feel something, you know. You should get out and do something. Go outside, run. They all sit up and look like they sleep, you know. And they, I want to find and get up look, and do Aaron something Baker, for them. three weeks ago, something would happen the other leg. Yes, I, I lost it. And here you are at the yes. Roosevelt Hotel right, in Hollywood. Right, right. This is... This this is, is this month would be the, the the third third month for third month for it for it to Look be out. Look at this. That's bumpy. And here, you, bumpy. Bumpy for my left leg and stumpy in the right. So set. you had two of them. Yes. But Laverne, you came right back first time. It's my two, first time I worked. And here at the Hollywood Roosevelt. Look yeah. at this. Yeah. Tonight, what a success. Yes. And I I was I had to uh, look at some of my words. You know, to familiar my mm -hmm. my mind. Right. You know, and after about maybe two days, I'll be fine. You know, uh -huh. but it was good. I was I was praise God. I was I felt good. The blues, that yeah. song, the blues. You yeah. felt like getting out of that chair. Didn't yeah, you? I do. Huh? I do. I, I thought you yeah. were gonna get up there and just. Get I jump, <laughs> jump around. You did. You yeah, did. You I did. The audience felt it too. Yeah. Laverne Baker started in show business. At what age? About thirteen or fourteen. Where? Where did Chicago, all my Chica home. Chicago. That's my home, yes. Is that your home? Yes. And your first club in Chicago? Uh, it was a little place in Chicago. Uh, I can't remember, when I remember the name of it. A lot of great singers. And come. then from there I went to Claire Clark, Claire Club Belisa, Denisa. Uh -huh. Did you work Montreal at that time? Oh, I love it. Margie, Mar we were talking about Margie. Yeah. We work Montreal. Yeah, me you? too. I Mr. Knew you what did. was his name? You worked on very nice, yeah, and we did the form. Uh -huh. Yeah, I went, I know, all all the way through, Toronto, Audio, uh -huh. uh -huh. Arta, uh -huh. Arpa. I did uh, many of them all the way to South Africa. How did Trinity Tweed come along with Laverne Baker, the first? Uh, the uh, I met I happen? met uh, Mr. Scott, and he was with the the group called the Cues. Uh huh. And we were in the studio with Armin Onigan in Atlantic. Uh -huh. And we were just fooling around. And he said, I got a little tune. I said, let me hear it. And we did 52 takes of Julie D. 52. 52 to get we one. And we still didn't have anything. Uh -huh. And I was sitting up there acting, acting stupid. And I went, umpy, umpy. He said, that's it. <laughs> and that's when what that sold the song, hand. When that song got on the radio, oh. Look at people were just tweeting. Yeah, didn't yeah. Right? How yeah. did Laverne Baker? Did you know it was going to be a hit? No, I, I didn't believe it. I really didn't. Like I didn't believe when Jim 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 uh -huh. Jimmy. I just, but I like the beat of Jim Danny. You know, doom 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 doom. Uh -huh. And I, you know, you can feel that. You know, the feet that the beat that you're getting, and you can uh, you can feel something from like all all of the music. From the 50s, 60s, up to the first or 70s, uh -huh. are best good music. I don't like the music now. You don't like the music? No. The singers today? I like the singers, 
but I don't like the tunes. You know, those, those, uh -huh. uh, the music, the, the, the emphasis, they just, they got, they got a, a drum, right. and they got a, uh, what is it, synthesizer, uh -huh. and, and that, that, that's nothing. Yeah. That's you right. know, I want to feel with the horns mm -hmm. and everything, and let's sing, let's do the show, you know. And uh, <laughs> the last uh, uh, album I just did with DJ, uh, DGA, uh -huh. and um, I told him, I said, I want, Full band, mm -hmm. don't give me all. I can't, I can't handle it. You know, uh, I did with the to the fire. What was that, huh? To the fire. Jump into the fire. Jump into, Jump the, into the, fire. the fire. Yeah, I did that. Yes. Yeah, I was in that. Uh -huh. In that. Yeah, it was about 32 of us. How many was. records, gold records, does Laverne Baker have? How many do you have? Uh, I see. Tweety D. You have many. I have many, yes, many, many. quite a few. I give a lot of them away, though. I give a, le a lot of them for different organizations. organizations. Yes, they so wanted. Laverne is concerned about the young kids today. I love the kids today. I just don't like the music, but I like right. their singing. Right. I like very much some. There's a couple of girls I've been listening to that were. I, I knew I could do something be better with their voices right. that you could do better now, uh -huh. you know? And I'm sure that a lot of the, the el older people with uh -huh. me, they feel the same thing, you know? But you, you, when, they, when these kids now, they're making money and that's what they, that they're doing. They're making money, so let them make money, you know? Laverne Baker, let's go back. Johnny Ray. Ah, Joni James. My friend. Uh, the Flamingo, was it the Flames? Flames King. The Flames right. at, in Detroit. Detroit, right. Tell me about that. The days with Johnny well, Ray. Well, listen, first. Johnny Ray, when he first came in, he couldn't even do nothing. Uh -huh. He just hollered. And uh, I liked him, and we used to get along in the dressing room. We'd go downstairs in the dressing room, and uh -huh. blah, blah, blah. you know, he couldn't hear good. You yes, know? I know. And everybody seemed to be, they would laugh at him, uh -huh. you know. And I always like, you know, I mean, I tried to make the best with other people, what they have. That's right. not that's not my business, you know. And I said, can you hear me? He, uh -huh. Yeah. He said, oh, we're going to jump, jump to the moves. You can give it. And I said, okay. I said, now, when we go back, Bob, when I got real tight with him, uh -huh. I said, come on. I said, we're going on rehearse. He said, okay. So I went in. I said, he, he played. Uh -huh. And then after that, he, he did and cry. I said, that, it's something like that uh -huh. we did. I don't know the song of it. And he would... Cause that was that was my that was my thing. I would do it on one uh -huh, knee, uh -huh. and I used to say, "I said, give it, I get you do it." So he got on his knees. That's, that's, where, it that's, all began. that's where he began. He took Laverne Baker's idea. Then. Yes, yes. With it, the shoe, and he got on his knee with the he, shoe. He, I cried. Yes, he okay. he gave me a whole new page, uh -huh. new page mm -hmm. of me. <laughs> it was such a wonderful thing with him, you uh -huh. know. And Joni, Joni James, she. My God, we just like, uh, we just did like, just, just, like I hold your hand like that. Right, right. We, we got stole, you know, I hear some, I used to believe you, so, and I, I used to just hear, because she had a, a, a sigh, a crime uh -huh. in her voice, right. like, you know, that's, and she was good. Laverne Baker, that's what makes a star. That's that right. identification, that yeah, certain right. sound. Yes. Is that right? That's true. Kids today don't have that certain sound. Well, they can, but like I said, they're busy making money. Making money. You know, uh -huh. these, I hear, I even hear the church songs, mm -hmm. you know, that, 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 and it, I don't, I don't feel nothing. Mm -hmm. I don't feel mm -hmm. nothing. You know, when I go to one of the real Baptist churches, you don't and feel I'll, it? No, not as much. I don't hear that. I want to hear that good spirit, mm -hmm. you know. Like Linda Hopkins when she gets up and sings. But not only that, yeah. you got you. You know, oh, I want to show you a thing. Yeah. When you hear an uh, act like check it back back uh, a a singer like J Linda, okay, yes. you sit down here and you listen to them and they look like this. But when you sing a singer like Linda, right. you 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 be you sitting there, you be moving, uh -huh. you feel uh -huh. something. That's what I'm saying. Uh -huh. You know, that's why I try to show some of the kids today uh -huh. to feel that what you got, use it. God yes. give you a talent, use it. Right. You know, and don't just 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 because you're making money. You know, because you can use. Look, look at Frank Sinatra mm -hmm. when he's 89. Uh, 80, uh, 89, 90, or something like that. Mm -hmm. Look at him, still singing. Still paying his dues. Still paying the dues, mm -hmm. and can still sing. 
Laverne Baker, what happened? You left America after the great success you had. Yeah. You packed your bags. You I entertained did. the military. I sure did. I, you know, I, I remember. <laughs> you went out there and you entertained all the wonderful boys in Vietnam and yes. Okinawa and Manila. Yes. And you stayed in Manila. I did. Why? Well, I, you know, the magical thing, my husband and I, and, and I was married to Flap, Slappy White, oh, the comedian. Of course, Slappy. Of course. Yeah, well, we're still married. He's still in town, too. I don't care. Isn't he? I don't care. You don't care? No. You don't see him? No. I haven't seen him in 25 years. You haven't seen Slappy in 25 years? He hasn't years? seen me, either. What happened there? Just wasn't together. Just wasn't But together. you're still married. That's what they say. Never got a divorce? No. Nice. He said, I never got one. Uh-huh. You know. But so uh, what happened? when so I got just... to start oh, working Manila. in Manila, I work Hong Kong. And while I was in Hong Kong, my agent that I worked from, from, the, from, from Vietnam, Vietnam. I, uh, he came he said, you want to go to Manila? So I said, yeah. So I, I closed out the, the club in, in uh, Hong Kong. I went to Manila. And then um, my uh, agent said, uh, you want to go down to the bases? Right. So I said, I'd love to. I did both all the bases. And then I, I met uh, Sergeant Hovis, Hovis. Right. And he said, oh, my God, Laverne Baker, Laverne Baker. And every week I was over there. Every we, week I made good they, money. I so made you stayed, good money. not just the money. You stay, stayed there for the boys. Stayed, you no, loved to entertain those No, troops. I didn't have a, bar, a boyfriend until no, about the, six years before I found a nice boyfriend. But they entertained the American troops. I had a ball. Even when, you know, when they blew up the, the guys in uh, in uh in Beirut? Beirut? Yes. Yes. Uh, I was with that troop. That troop. Went down. When they walked out, I was like, and we were, everybody, were, we were all in, 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 the, in the hall like this. And everybody, you could see everybody just, tears just rolling. Because we just walked, just like this. And they uh -huh. were gone. Uh -huh. Jesus, it hurt us so bad. And my commander, you know, he said, Laverne. Mm -hmm. And so what we did is uh, we had to do uh, we had to do a regular show that night, uh -huh. so I took a table like this, mm -hmm. and I took a, a black tablecloth, uh -huh. put around it with a big uh, white mm -hmm. white li 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 lilies mm -hmm. around around it with white mm -hmm. with flowers around, oh, it. and on that one on that one table was at the door, and nobody touched on it. Mm -hmm. That was our real respect to our boys, you know. But um, Laverne this, Baker. The boys here in America love you. Hey, they're so and nice. The audience tonight here at the Roosevelt showed how much they love Laverne they, Baker. Hey, I appreciate the comeback it. for Laverne Baker after I, I really three appreciate years. It. Praise three God. years. Almost you going up to three now. Going up. Must have felt good to be on that stage. It was <laughs> back then. Back. Yeah. It was. is, right? Yeah, man. What's going to happen to Laverne Baker? And leaving the, uh, you're going to be at Roosevelt for a few weeks. Yes. For and the then whole I'm month, going for the whole month? No, just for two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. And then from what? I'm going back home uh -huh. to New York, New York. And, and try to get my... See, I, I, I had an apartment and in Long Island, my own little apartment. Uh -huh. But, and, but my, my sister, she kept me uh, near by the doctor at right. her apartment. Mm -hmm. And my sister died in April. I see. So now I have the apartment. Mm -hmm. So I, have, I, took, I had to take everything over my house uh -huh. and put it over here. So now I gotta clean my house and get done, you know, painting and everything, get it fixed. So I'm gonna fix it up with a studio, you know. Come fix. On, Baker. Oh, that's Look, right. th looking back, what has been the hardest for you? This must have been the hardest in your life, has it? The hardest thing now for me is, 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 is these three years that I haven't been able to go over and see my kids. Has that been the hardest? They're still there. They are. Yes. And I know somebody's taking care of them, but I, I are know, they here in Los Angeles? No, they're in Lungapal. Lungapal. Oh, in Manila. Yes. I in, see. In, in, in the front of Philippines. In the Philippines. And I want to see body get. I'm going in. That's why I'm, I'm holding like this for mm -hmm. June for 
December when mm -hmm. the weather's good, mm -hmm. and I'm going back to get my go back. Yeah, you know I'll just get in town. You know who's in town? One of your ladies, Polita Carellis. Where? She's here in Vegas working right now, Margie. Oh, She's here working. wow. She's here for uh, three weeks working some, oh. somewhere in Las Vegas. You know where? I'll try to, I'll, call, I'll call Ruth Brown. She right, knows she where knows, she's yes, working. Yeah. Right, right. That's my friend. I know she is. Yeah. One of Manila's greats. Great singers, yeah. Yes, was, uh, Sing from one side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's yeah, right. her. She had her own television show. Remember that time? Yes, yeah. Looking back, you've had a good time, though. Would yes. You say? Hey, God has been beautiful. Beautiful, and he still is. Okay. I don't re regret anything, including my legs. I don't regret. You don't regret? No. no? Because I, he saved my life. You know? Has this religion brought you very close now? The, the I'm all, I've, I've always been You've close. Always been I've always been close, close mm -hmm. to God because mm -hmm. I grew up that way. Mm -hmm. And but, you know, I wasn't like like this. Yes. Now I'm like this. You know, uh -huh. um, I try to do what's right. You know, uh -huh. I try to keep my mind. Uh, if if I know somebody I know is wrong me, I, I can ignore ignore it. Before I used to, I couldn't ignore it, you know. And you know, like you say, blah, 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 and I saw, and just keep on. I know if you're going, if you're going to be all right with me, you're just not all right with me, okay? Mm -hmm. So just, then why should we argue about right, this, right. you know? So that's the way I do now, you know. I just try to take. I'll, you, you, you you're get, taking day one day at a time. Time Is that one time. And you try to get you try to get things that give you the strength, mm -hmm. you know, and. Uh, to have courage to other people, and you can help good for someone else, you know. You say, oh, I, she didn't mean that, you know. Like I told a lady at the airport, she didn't know that she went, walked, walked up to me, uh -huh. and she said, would you want to stand up, please, and take and let me take uh -huh. all your stuff? I said, lady, I would love to stand up. And she said, oh, my God. She said, I'm sorry. I said, no, you didn't know, uh -huh. you know. You know, I said, no, no, and she felt bad. I said, no, no, no. And I was laughing. I said, no, 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 don't, don't feel bad. Uh -huh. You know, you didn't know. Mm -hmm. You know, you didn't look at my legs. You uh -huh. just, just looked at my face, mm -hmm. you know. So she felt really felt bad, you know, at the airport. Laverne, you've had a great life. Yeah. They did a story on Josephine Baker. They did stories on all these, a lot of stars. Laverne Baker, a movie about you. A movie would be so. Jack, a, a film on Laverne Baker. At this moment of time, the only thing I want would be uh, well. Are you uh, writing a book right now? I'm trying to do a book, and I'm trying to get one of them stars out there. That's I right. think I deserve one. You, you don't have a star in Hollywood. No. Either? Well, we're going to worry on that. I've right been now. I've been working since okay. 1951. You ain't give me no star. No, we're going to get you one right now. Yeah. Laverne Baker. Let's get back with the movie. Yeah. The book. I want to. Um, I want to do the get a book. tape recorder. Talk on the tape recorder. Talk yeah, all these right, days right. And the wonderful, because that's how you get the book started. Yeah, well, I got my brother. I got my my uh -huh. praise and my sweetheart over there, uh -huh. and I got another friend. Cause you have a lot to and, say. Um, Chips, you know Chips, uh -huh. the writer. Mm -hmm. I want with all these with these three people with you know piece of yours, right. a piece of his, right. but that, and we're going to try to book a book, you know. Yeah, great book, great yeah. movie. You had yeah. a great life. I Bern did. Baker, I really enjoy talking to you. Tonight. Thank you. And I'm so happy you're back working again. It's good God. to see you good again too. God, my I'm goodness. I'm so happy that Laverne yeah. Baker's back. Yeah. What, what, what are you? 36 now? Or 30, <laughs> <laughs> nice talking to you, Darrell. It's a pleasure. We're going to go right back to your songs right now. Okay? Thank you. God Thank bless. You. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. Thank Give you. me my pen. <laughs>